Rodrigo Tafur, and I'm a painter, an artist. I was born in Arequipa, and I currently live in Lima. Like six, sometimes seven paintings at the same time, because while I'm painting one, the other is drying, and while that is, while that painting is drying, the other one is still white. So I have to, I, I can do a lot of of things at the same time. Um, actually, not about red. They are about color. symbolizes the, the fight of the, a human being for recognizing himself. Color obviously keeps, uh, keeps being the most important thing.
have uh, one brother, my father, my mother, uh, my grandmother, my two uncles, and my, most of them, uh, they, I love them, and they uh, support me. In, they support me in my choice of being an artist. They love the idea of me being an artist, I think. Each of us have like a, this temple of dreams inside. And this, uh, this temple of dreams, you also you recognize just yourself in a, I don't know, in a, in this archetype. It could be a hero a counterpart, and there is always a, a task to do. Uh, this task could be as a little boy to cross the street and um, then to finish your career, then to make a huge painting, I don't know, something that like, gives you joy to finish and it's hard to do. My mind, I think, is my father, uh, because he gives it all, because he, he doesn't measure things uh, with a ruler. He measured it, it with hard work and with all the things he could do for his two sons. He, I don't know, he just keeps giving and giving and giving and giving and giving and never, never ends. And I, I'm sure that he won't be, he won't stop giving. Symbolizes the person itself. Everyone is a hero in his own mind. Everybody is a hero uh, in his life. He, they, they all they all have different tasks, these different enemies. Enemies, not not really arch enemies, <laughs> but uh, things to defeat that are not other people, but are inside. And that's why the hero is important because it represents the person who has defeated his own fears. The person who has defeated, defeated who has made their his, their dreams appear, fight for them, not magically, but with hard, hard work and a lot of uh, will. Perfect. Art school. Well, I, I don't know. I, I was the worst student. And the best one at the uh, at the end uh, in grades. I mean, at first I, it was really difficult for me. I didn't comfort with my teachers. They taught, they tried to teach me, but it, I was I wasn't listening. And hard work was not in my mind that time. But the last three years, uh, I recognized that. Actually, hard work is the only way. And I start listening to them, and <laughs> and suddenly I start improving. I start liking my paintings more. I start dis discovering, finding things that I wouldn't find, I could not find by myself. Faculty of Arte, the Faculty of Arts of the University, the Universidad Católica del Perú. It's a really tedious career, it's six years, and in those six years, in the specialty of painting, you just paint, and paint, and paint, and paint, and paint, and, and kind, of kind of lose your mind just to paint better, <laughs> but uh, to be a better worker, to understand that art is not playing, that art is not, painting is not just a hobby for me is a vocation and you need to follow it with 100% you need to give it all uh, archetypes I think it was recently that I discovered archetypes but it all began in a funny way because I was uh, painting in my university studio, which was really, really small, 
uh, really tight space. And uh, I was painting, and suddenly a teacher knocks the door. Uh, Eduardo Tokeshi. And he started telling me this is the comments about my, my paintings, and one of them, I don't know, it, it makes, it made a chip turn on. Journey of climbing the mountain that intrigues me. And that's how I, I start the, uh, searching for adventures, searching for archetypes, searching for myths, and they all uh, result in the same way. The no, no, yeah, actually that's it. The path, the path of finding. It's not the, the finding of it itself. It's the path. It's the, the journey one took. And suddenly I came to Campbell. He made my, my life quite easier, I think. 